Prepare to stand out. Resume photos, photo and interview outfit. Your CV is now complete. All it misses is the required set of professional photos. A full length and a half length photo must accompany every single application. We suggest that you check on the company website what are the sizes and backgrounds requirements for the CV photos because they are different from an airline to another or might change over time. Your photos are just as important as your CV. So make sure they speak a thousand words about what a professional, dedicated, friendly, customer service oriented, team player, impeccably groomed, wonderful person you are. Your attitude and posture must be natural and positive. Make sure you face the camera and give a genuine smile. Ladies need to wear earrings and any visible jewelry must be discreet. Both legs and arms need to be visible. Do not hide or cross them. We highly recommend taking both photos in a professional studio and at all the same time so your outfit is identical in both pictures. The photo outfit, much like the outfit you will be wearing during the interview, should be a well-fitted suit in office-appropriate colors like black, grey, light, grey or navy blue with matching shoes. Make sure your suit is not too tight because it might restrict your movement and can affect the outcome of your reach test. The shirt must be perfectly ironed, especially during the assessment day, because some recruiters might ask you to remove your jacket. Ladies, we strongly encourage you to wear a dress or skirt suit with white or light pastel colors shirt and skin color stockings. The skirt or dress should not be shorter than knee length. Although business attire for ladies doesn't necessarily mean skirt and jacket, the skirt will give you a much more feminine, elegant look and it makes it easier for the recruiters to actually picture what you would look like in the airline uniform. If you wish to wear a smart looking dress instead of skirt and shirt with a jacket, it is absolutely perfect as well. The shoes should be complementing your outfit and should be medium or high heeled. Also depending on your height, plain and without an ankle strap or open toe. If you feel you are pretty plain coloured during the interview day and want to add some glamour to the outfit, you can wear a bright colour scarf that goes well with the rest of the outfit. However, we advise that you don't wear the scarf when taking the photos. It could do more damage to the overall image than enhance it. Gentlemen's attire would have to follow the same guidelines. The colour range should also be similar and the glamour factor can be obtained with the help of a well-chosen tie, a big bold colour of socks and a da daringly coloured shoelace. The belt should be of plain design, leather made with a classical buckle and not too thick. We recommend lace-ups for your shoe choice. They look much more professional than slip-ins and are much closer to the shoe design of most airlines in the world. It is important to remember that these are detailed guidelines of the standards followed by most airlines. However, recruitment can be an emotional thing and although the major guidelines need to be followed, we encourage you to integrate your own personality into your outfit. As the saying goes, dress how you want to be addressed. Make sure that Whatever outfit you decide to wear for the interview, you feel confident in it and it is reflecting who you are as an individual and as a professional.